So let's head over to the rhythm dance. Uh, in first place, we have Piper Gillis and Paul Poirier of Ontario. In second place, we have Lawrence Fournier Boudry and Nikolai Sorensen of Quebec. And in third place, we have Marjorie Lejoie and Zachary Lega from Quebec as well. Pretty much what we expected given what these teams have been putting down internationally. Mm -hmm. um, wh what did you think of uh, our first place finishers uh, and reigning Canadian champions, Piper and Paul? I love this program. I love the outfits. I love their energy. I love that they just like, they're their own thing, you know? Like no one in the world is like Piper and Paul. And uh, this program, every single time they do it, I'm, I'm smiling. I love his mustache too, it was great. Um, I mean, I'm not the ice dance expert. You are. I wouldn't say it was like as put perfect as I've seen. Yeah, put me on the spot. I'm going to just throw, you know, figure it out. Uh, I think it wasn't as perfect as I've seen them, but it mm. was, you know, there were little moments where their, their legs didn't match as much as I've seen before. Little things here and there, but I thought their energy was great. And um, obviously the class of the field and they're looking strong and building for, uh, for the Olympics. And it's um, very interesting because, you know, at the start of the season when they were brought this music, uh, it actually was for a different team, but uh, Paul and Piper immediately started dancing to it. They really enjoyed it. And they really um, vibed with the energy of Elton John, which is just being unapolog unapologetically Elton John. Um, <laughs> colorful, debonair, uh, witty, uh, creative. Mm -hmm. And that's kind of where we've seen Piper and Paul really um, manifest their power as an ice dance team. Um, with this uh, rhythm dance, you know, with the Grand Prix final being canceled, they definitely made a lot of changes. I love the uh, new dance to close out the program. Heading into this competition, of course, with, you know, the worries about COVID, Piper spoke about how they're not really focusing on that they're doing everything that they can do to control what they can control uh, whether it be where they're going in the rink um where they're warming up staying away from other competitors um but you know not really thinking about that dramatic uh thought of if i test positive my olympic career could be over and um you know showing us why they are the top team and why they are going to be canada's metal hopefuls at the olympic games moving on to second place uh i love this team like i always love this team every single time they come up i'm like i love this team like it's the first time i've said it i say it every single time i'm sick of myself at this point they did really well here maxing out on almost all their levels except in the uh, midline step sequence and i believe their partial uh step um laurence is a superstar um Honestly, Nikolai is great as well, but sometimes she goes into the air. I'm like, how'd she do that? I'm like, oh yeah, she has a partner who lifts her. This um, George Michael rhythm dance has been a really great vehicle for them uh, on the Grand Prix circuit and here at home. And they'll definitely be a force to reckon with on the international circuit when they head to the Olympic games. Love this team. <laughs> and of course, in third place, the young team of Marjorie Lejoie and Zachary Lega. Energy. -a. Like just <laughs> energy, energy, energy. What a good Three. choice for them, too. That music oh, yeah. is just so yeah. perfect. Yeah. 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 He, the exact opposite of, um, of Lawrence and Nikolai, I watch him constantly. And to be honest, for the first time, I think he was outshone and not by his partner, but by that awesome purple leopard jacket. I want it, <laughs> <laughs> give it to me. Um, and it's gonna it'll look better on me, to be honest. But again, they are the better on you. <laughs> this is true. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I think the main story here is that battle for that last position between Marjorie and Zach and Carolyn. So Cease and uh, Shane Fierce, but given the international results that they both have had in comparison, I do think Marjorie and Zach are kind of locked in for that third spot, uh, but you never know. It is still a competition. Ice is slippery. Things do happen. 
Hey guys, it's Asher and Dylan from That Figure Skating Show. And if you like this video, and don't lie, we know you did, there's actually more where that came from. So subscribe to CBC Sports and click it. Click, click, click it real good. good. Da, na, na.